Hey guys, and welcome back to another Dollar Tree haul. I'm so excited that you're here, so excited um, that you clicked on this video to watch this Dollar Tree haul. I am really excited to share with you guys everything that I found um, at Dollar Tree this week, so let's get into it. All right, guys, so I have some stocking stuffer ideas in here um, every year. We have two dogs, if you're new, Atticus and Lola, a French Bulldog and a Pug and they are our babies we don't have human babies but every year we get some stuff uh for my mom which is what they call they call her mimi um so i've got some stuff for her in there from the babies i've got stocking stuff for ideas um i've said this a thousand times but my dad and my sister are coming in a couple of weeks and so i have little advent calendar bags for them i have some gifts for my brother in here so i'm really excited to share with you guys Everything that I found, so let's get into it. First of all, this is not an item for any of those people that I've just named. This is solely for me and for my husband. But Dollar Tree has them every year. Um, I just decided to pick them up this year, and they are their stirring spoons, the milk chocolate ones. And I was really excited about these. I scooped up last year. They had the peppermint spoons, but I haven't seen those yet out but I am on the lookout for them. And then I hauled a couple of weeks ago. Um, they have the hot chocolate bombs out. They have the little cups that are not like the size of a shot glass and they're peppermint, um, the entire thing is. Um, but yeah, I just got these spoons. I'm really excited about them because I definitely have hot chocolate more times than I would like to admit during the holiday season. But I got that. Also, I'm not gonna go in any particular order today. Um, I'm just, I have one bag that is stuffed to the brim and I'm just going to grab at random. So just bear with me on that. Um, also my brother, I have two brothers, one that's 28 and one that's 25 and the middle one, the one that's 25, um, he, he loves gifts, but he just loves to open stuff. So I do shop for purpose with him, um, you know, because I don't, because he lives with my mom, so I don't want to just buy random things that they won't use, but still just things that are inexpensive because I'm telling you guys, he just loves to open gifts. So one thing that I got him was this men shave kit and it comes with a cream and then an aftershave. And I, it says cedar wood and eucalyptus. And they had a different one there too. Um, I think it was maybe apple or maybe cinnamon, something like that. But I just I just thought this would smell really good and that he would like it. So I got that for him. Also, the main reason that I went to Dollar Tree was for my brother. And then I came out like only, I say only, but I went in there planning to spend $5. And I came out spending about 20 So, but that's usually how it goes at Dollar Tree. Another thing that I got was for my uh, little sister um, for her advent calendar. She just likes Skittles. So I put these in there. Well, I haven't yet. I'm going to. So I got that for her. Mom, if you're watching this part, just kind of fast forward just a little bit. Um, but this is for, actually, I'll just save it to the end. I'll just save it to the end so that she can click off at the appropriate time. Thing that I got was for um, my brother as well. And he loves calendars and he loves all things nature. Um, so I just got him this super cute wildlife um, calendar starting obviously next year. And my ring light is really washing this out, but it just has some really cute stuff on there. And they had tons and tons of uh, different, they always do different calendars, but I knew that he would like this one. So that's the one that I snagged for him. He is, my brother, he is super into doing word searches. Um, as if he doesn't have enough already. So I just picked up two for him. Um, just a big, a great big word find. And then this one is a Bible word find. So I just got these for him, just large print. So I got those for him and I'll, and I'll wrap these each individually so it's more stuff for him to get to open. Going along with my brother, he does not, I asked my mom, 
He does not need any more pins. Absolutely not. They He buys them every single time that they go shopping. But I saw this one, and I thought it was pretty cool. It's nothing new to Dollar Tree. Um, but I just thought it was cool, and I knew, at least I thought he didn't have anything like this. Um, and it's just a cute little blue pin. But what it's really cool about it is you see these little lines right here or not lines whatever they're called the little push buttons you push it down and whatever color it is that's what color ink it writes with so there's yellow blue black red purple orange another blue another red green and that's all i could see but i just thought that was super cute and fun um and hit and this this the actual pin itself is blue and that's his favorite color so i got that for him as well next couple of things that i got are just some picture frames I got three of them um, because for our, our grandparents on my husband and my side um, I'm gonna print out some picture like some family photos um, and put them in here for them just easy simple little gifts I mean this was a dollar it's a four by six frame and you go to um, Walgreens and you print out a four by six photo for 50 60 something cents like that less than a dollar so this is a super inexpensive gift but still very personal so if you're wanting to shop for people but you don't have a huge budget pictures are definitely definitely the way to go um if you saw my last video then you saw that i'm pretty much doing like a um like the brown paper bag gold that kind of rustic look if you will um and i incorporated some red into it because i really liked the way that the red looked so when i was at dollar tree i just picked up a couple more bags i should have gotten um they had this size which is kind of small and then they had like a bigger size than this just a little bit bigger and i kind of wish that i would have grabbed the um the bigger ones as well but i guess that just gives me another reason to go back to dollar tree so <laughs> The next thing that I got is for my dad for his advent calendar bag. And he said that he likes Heath bars, so I just grabbed these, the little miniature ones. I grabbed those for him. Also, um, while my dad and my sister are here, it's going to be my dad's birthday as well. Um, and so, I was going to make him a cake. But I think instead, what I'm going to do, this is just off topic, but if you want to know, then I guess you'll get to know. Um, is at Walmart, like when you first walk into like the bakery side, um, they have those little individual like pies, um, and he loves pie, so I think I'm gonna get him one of those, because on his birthday, we're actually, uh, we're going to Universal for the entire day, so we won't really be able to, I won't, I was gonna make him a cake, but I felt like it would go to waste, um, and he wouldn't get to fully enjoy it, because we'd be gone, all day so I just thought a pie was more realistic anyways uh, all that is a really long explanation to tell you that I bought some candles and the birthday boy thing for him which the birthday boy is the main reason that I got it so I can stick it in his pie and his birthday is December 16th and then Atticus our French Bulldog his birthday is the 18th so I'll be able to have this as well for his um, I don't know if we're gonna do for Lola, her birthday was in November, and we made her a cake, uh, a doggy-approved cake, but um, I stuck a little cookie on top that said princess. So I don't know if we're going to make a cake for him too, for Atticus as well. I don't know. I don't know. But irrelevant information. But, so I got that for both of them. The next thing that I got for my brother, kind of going along with the shave set, was just some razors. And I was going to get, they have this brand as well, uh, um, and the shaving cream, and I was going to get that, but then I saw that cute little set, and I didn't want to pass up on it, so I just got these and then that shave set. I thought it was super cute. The next couple of things that I got are, it's just candy, um, but I got some Hershey's for my dad because he said that he likes Hershey's as well, so that'll probably, I don't know if that'll be... Um, 
in like two separate bags or if I'm gonna put all both of his candies together in one bag I'm not sure I'll have to look and, and then I'll just decide um, and then my sister as if I needed more things for her advent calendar bag I got her some candy as well she likes Kit Kats and the Skittles and then I also got the three musketeers for my dad as well so that is all the candy that I got I got a lot but they like it so okay um, I'm gonna leave the last two things aside because those will be for my mom so she can just click, you know, towards the end or whatever. Sorry guys, I had to restart it because my dog started barking at the Amazon guy. Anyways, I was super, super, super excited to find this, which is what I'm about to show you because I've seen different people haul it, but I myself have never found it. It is a Greenbrier product, which means it could show up at your stores because that is Dollar Tree brand. But it's a, it's a wall shelf. And it's just a little shelf that sits like this um, on your wall. But the string, and that's what it looks like. Like, what? As if Dollar Tree couldn't blow our minds anymore, I found this wall shelf. I... I was so, I am speechless, obviously. I just, I don't know where I'm going to put this. I told my husband when I came home, I showed this to him, and he's like, so who's that going to be a gift for? And I was like, myself. Like, I'm not giving this away. Um, but I found, whoops, I found this in the, I'm just going to set it down before I break it. I, I found it in the, um, where they keep like their candles and their um, like their wax melts. I found it, uh, you know, some of their little decor signs. I've hauled them before, uh, or not hauled them, but I've I've um, when I did a shop with me, I shown I showed some of them. Um, it's kind of if you know what section I'm talking about, it's kind of in that section along with the picture frames, and that's where I found it. So, again. Not everything is always in its place at Dollar Tree, um, but most of the time it is, and that is where I found it. But, oh, we have a little visitor. Hello, this is Atticus, if you have not met him yet. He's a big boy. He's a big boy. He is going to be three, and I cannot believe it. Nope. Okay, the last two things that we have are for my mom. So, mom, if you're watching, this is where you can exit. Goodbye. See you later. But for everyone else, let's keep going. Two things for her are going to be from our dogs. Atticus is upset because he wants this for himself, but he can't have it. So, it's just a fun little gift. Um, yeah, see, he's upset. It's just a fun little gift for my mom. I thought it was super cute. I couldn't pass up on it. She loves Winnie the Pooh, the whole gang, but she especially loves Pooh. And I found this little, there's nothing to it. It's just a little, a little toy. It doesn't have a squeaker or anything. But I thought he was so cute, so fluffy. So I just got him for my mom from the babies. Yep, see, he wants it really bad. He's upset. I actually had this bag sitting right here in the floor because I was like, okay, I'm going to do a Dollar Tree haul. And he had already seen the Pooh Bear and he just sat there just staring at the bag, laying there, just staring at it, upset, whining because he couldn't get it. So my husband took him outside and I moved the bag and, and it was fine. But it, it was a whole thing, you guys, if, if you couldn't tell already. The very last thing that we got, that I got for her, uh, that's going to be from the babies, <laughs> is a calendar. And if you know my mom, then you know she tries very hard, but she forgets things. And we all love her to death, and we love her in spite of it, but she forgets a lot of things, and she'll make a grocery list and then leave it at home. And it's just, it's a whole thing, people. So, kind of, I got it as a serious thing, but I also kind of got it as a joke, um, because she finds it funny as well that she can never remember anything. But I did get it, you know, seriously so she could actually hopefully use it. Um, but it's just this super cute little calendar and it's got a little note section and a little to-do list down here. I don't think... 
No, it's sadly it's not magnetic. I wasn't for sure if it was or not. Um, but either way, she can keep it in her little room um, at her desk and, and work on things or, you know, doctor's appointments, you know, whatever. Um, I just thought it was super cute, very inexpensive, um, and hopefully she will like it. That's going to be it for today's haul. I hope that you enjoyed it. I hope that it gave you some ideas. Um, Atticus is over here whining for Pooh Bear. I don't, I don't know if you'll be able to hear him, but... Anyways, I hope that you guys enjoyed it. I hope you enjoyed the shop with me. Sorry I didn't announce that at the beginning. Um, but anyways, yes, I hope that you enjoyed that. Um, I will have a video coming. Let me see. I'm going to probably record some of it in the next day or so. Um, it's going to be pretty much an Amazon haul is what it's going to be. Um, but I won't have stuff coming in until it was a like two part order so some of it's here and then the rest of it will be here next week so it'll probably be a part one and part two of the haul just so i can go on and get stuff uh recorded and then wrapped up for everybody but anyway stay tuned for that video um in that video i'll probably throw in some other things that i've bought from like ross um just because i it's it's literally like four things um and it's not enough to make a video of its own so i'll just probably throw it in with that one as well but that's it I hope that you enjoyed this haul. I hope that you look forward and you subscribe so you can see my future videos, so you can see the Amazon video that's coming. Let me know in the comments below what you want to see from me, and I can do my very best to uh, accommodate that for you guys. But I hope that you enjoy this video, and I will see you soon.